the next the retreat has been an amazing opportunity to to share a little bit about what I really, really believe is true for all of us, for each and every single person. Um, I believe that our next is always in this. I actually believe that our next is now. The moment that you realize that you are positioned to be next, it really is now. I live my life by the scripture. The scripture says, and now unto him who's able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we could ask or think according to the power that worketh in us, it is now that we should reach for our next, that new position, the new opportunity, the new thought track, the new think track, the new set of friends, the new set of people, the new you, the you that didn't believe that you could do it. And that's what happened today in the retreat. We were able to activate and engage. Um, I, I didn't get a chance to say this, but I find so many times that people become encased in their truth because they know what they've done, because they know the life that they've lived, because sometimes it isn't exemplary, um, sometimes we make mistakes, sometimes we live in manners that are not conducive to a, a good Christian way of living. I think that we get stuck somehow believing that that impacts God, but God never changes. So he is not intimidated by your habits or your proclivities nor is he even afraid of your truth. The things that are true about you, God is not afraid of that. He's not intimidated. Be strong from the day, from today on. He's a promise keeper. And he's promised all of us um, that he knows the thoughts he has for us and they're good thoughts with an expected end and a plan for us to prosper. And I encourage every single person listening to this, whatever you do, Make your next now.